So one of the uh, great things about uh, owning any Android device is getting to build your own versions of everything, whether it's Team Win Recovery Project or whether it's the ROM that you're using. It's just really nice to be able to build it yourself. So first off, you know exactly what's in it, and you uh, can uh, minutely change things that uh, might be interesting to you. And so that's what I've done today with the, um, the Bass, which is the code name for the Urbane, the original uh, LG uh, Urbane. And so uh, first off, I would like to point out that I did not make the device tree for this one. Um, it was here under Team Win for Android device LGE Bass, or Bass, depending on how you want to say it. And uh, so they have a branch for Android 5.0, and that's what they use to build Team Win Recovery Project for this, uh, this device. So it's really uh, really great um, just being able to grab that. And of course, we just download that uh, as a zip. And then uh, after extra extracting that download, uh, we're using our Mini Twerp Omni 5.11, which I know you're like, well, this is 5.0 and this is 5.11. Usually they're so close, uh, especially for building Omni that, uh, or excuse me, not for building Omni, but for building Twerp Team Win Recovery Project, since it's only using the recovery portion, that really works out in our favor. Now, I did want to make sure uh, to do something unique, so that way you knew uh, not only that I was building it, I'm sure you guys trust me by now, but that uh, would make it a little more interesting. And so what I did is uh, I took the slider, I guess I should go find it, so bootable recovery, uh, and then we go down to GUI, and then we go to theme, and we look at the watch because this is going to be for the watch. We don't have to worry about all the other areas, and we go to image. And down here at the bottom is the slider. Normally, this slider would have two play buttons on it to make a fast forward symbol, uh, showing you that you need to slide it to the right. And uh, since I figure everybody knows to slide it to the right by now, I went ahead and changed it, modified it. I took my um, icon and uh, I uh, superimposed it on top of the slider and then I put that into the build so that way I could actually build it uh, and I would see every time like the unlock screen came open it would uh, ask me to slide my slider as well so that would be maybe kind of a fun thing to do um, if we since we've downloaded that folder with the bass we of course put it in device and I made an LGE folder that was empty and then put the bass folder in there and this is all the stuff that's in it uh, very 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 much the same as building for any Android device whether you're building for a watch or for a phone the team win recovery project portion works exactly the same but we're gonna go ahead and go over it anyways uh, once again you have the board config this specifies things like your architecture and uh, what uh, system on chip that you're using and um, it uh, tries to include anything that needs to be included as well uh, and a few um, you know things about the kernel the partition sizes and that sort of thing just like we've seen in all of our other uh, videos and of course the important one the Omni Bass which tells that this is Omni Bass so you can actually choose to build that as uh, as when you type it in it will look for that file and then the vendor setup shell file that adds it to your lunch combo which is really really handy so if you need help with setting up Team Win Recovery Project, especially for doing mini or anything like that, I have many, many, many videos on how to do that. Today we're just looking at building for the uh, the bass, um, and um, so we'll we'll go ahead and get started with that build. So let me shrink this down here. So we're in our folder for uh, mini twerp Omni 5.11 and we're going to build environment setup and notice that it's now including device LGE bass vendor setup shell so it's adding these to the list and we're going to say lunch uh, omni and uh, bass dash ing and it says hey you're going to build that this is all the specs for it 
looks good. And then we're going to MKA recovery image. So again, I already have uh, Omni set up for building the mini twerp uh, and that sort of thing. Uh, I do have a lot of videos on how to set up Team Win Recovery Project or Omni for building Team Win Recovery Project using many both of um, Lineage and of Omni and various versions thereof that you can download and work with. So uh, if you need any help with that, be sure to check out my other videos. We're going to let this build. It's going to take about 10 minutes and uh, when it's done we'll take a look at what we get. Obviously if there's any errors along the way we'll check those out too. Okay so that took about <clears throat> oh, five or six minutes. I thought it'd probably take around 10 but it was a little faster than I thought. And uh, you know of course it uh, made the recovery image uh, successfully. All was well. Um, and then we see it here in the out target product bass right here. So uh, the great thing is I already have Team Win Recovery Project on the smartwatch and so I can just install it as an image but also you can install this using Fastboot. I have lots of videos on how to use Fastboot to uh, flash a partition and that is uh, you know a really easy simple way to go especially if you're putting it on something for the first time um, like if you were going to make something for your own smartwatch that maybe hasn't been made already and it's really handy to have even for a smartwatch because I like to back it up so that way if it ever for some reason gets reset you can just actually reload the uh, the already configured backup that you have instead of having to go through and configure all the apps again so really really handy especially if your smartwatch might get upgrades in the future um, that can be a little bit problematic if you don't like the new upgrade you can always go back and so things like that to consider so I'm gonna put this on the uh, smartwatch and we'll take a look alright and so here is a uh, picture that I took and uh, Sorry for the poor quality. It's kind of hard to get the lighting right. Take a picture of the screen, um, dims everything else down. Take a picture of everything else, and the screen is too bright to, to see. But as you can see, there's my little uh, icon there, the Alaska Linux user mark on the uh, slider. And so that was uh, just, I thought, a nice touch. You're welcome to do stuff like that when you make your own Team Win Recovery projects. If you're not making official team win recovery project uh, <clears throat> builds and you're doing unofficial builds you can really do whatever you want um, and uh, and nobody has any problem with that you know that's it's just kinda why we do custom ROMs and custom team win recovery project uh, I do have videos all about how to customize team win recovery pro project and some of the things that you can do in there changing fonts and doing that for ROMs as well so be sure to check those out if you need some uh, some help with that but uh, here we had a successful build, and uh, hopefully uh, you guys will be out there building for um, your smartwatches as well.